I want to begin with that breaking news alert tonight. The manhunt is over for the second suspect accused of trying to shoot two Beaumont police officers at the Glen Oaks apartments on Dallin. Our cameras were rolling this new video tonight showing 18 year old Reginald Guillory who turned himself in within the past hour. And as you can see, he was taken into custody. He was wanted on two warrants for aggravated assault on a public servant. Yesterday, police arrested 17 year old Jalen Nixon on the same charges. He's currently behind bars on bonds totaling a million dollars. Good evening, Southeast Texas. I'm Jordan Williams. That scary scene unfolded at an apartment complex on Sunday in the heart of the West End. And tonight, investigators are still trying to piece everything together and exactly what led to that attempted shooting. 12 News reporter Gloria Walker spoke with Beaumont police. and We're going to check in with her. Perhaps. What was supposed to be a routine call on Sunday led officers to be staring down a gun pointed right at them. They responded to the Glen Oaks apartments after receiving a call regarding a civil standby. That means officers go help with two disagreeing parties when they're in need of police presence to help remove property. But when the police showed up, they were met with a violent confrontation. Two armed suspects opening the door of the apartment and trying to shoot the officers. But it malfunctioned and um, then both suspects kind of fled back into the apartment. And so from there, um, our officers are going to, to respond to the way that they're trained. This mishap saved the officers' lives. In case, we were very grateful that, that that's what happened. So, uh, but again, still under investigation, so the, the circumstances surrounding every detail are still being looked into. Um, but yeah, just all around a very scary scenario, and we're just grateful that the outcome was not anyone being injured or killed. 17-year-old Jalen Nixon was arrested after trying to run from police, and police say Reginald Guillory just turned himself in this evening. Beaumont police say they're reminded every day just how dangerous this job is. Just to make sure that we stay on our toes and always be aware that um, any situation can change in just a split second. Gloria Walker reporting for us. Let's turn